France and India are celebrating this year 25 years of strategic partnership, so which it's a framework to take our bilateral relation on a very high level of ambition based on our common vision to help each other to build strategic autonomy. So this is based on defense and security cooperation, economic cooperation, nuclear energy cooperation, science and education cooperation. And this is a very high level of ambition. Next week at our national day, uh, President Emmanuel Macron has invited Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi to be the guest of honor. And uh, they will adopt a roadmap to take our bilateral relation on the highest level for the next 25 years. So this shows the, the friendship, the trust and the level of ambition we share between France and India national agencies, nuclear agencies for decades now. And in terms of education, we run university cooperation on a very dynamic uh, momentum. Here in Tamil Nadu, we have reached uh, a record of 110 MOUs between French and Indian university only for Tamil Nadu, very dynamic with exchange of students, with dual degrees. Um, we signed a, a bilateral agreement for academic degree recognition, so now all our partnership can allow students, Indian and French, to join whatever university in both our countries. Variety of tools to build a cooperation between universities and research institutions. So first it can be exchange of students, uh, which I would say the first step, and then the highest level would be dual degree, having uh, allowing the students, French and Indian, in a batch to study at the same time the French and the Indian degree with mutual recognition. So this is the, the highest level of cooperation and we run that uh, with few in, uh, universities uh, here in the south of India. For example, in Pondicherry we have a dual degree in um, uh, economic and social administration and we are building one um, in, in, uh, with the IIT Madras and the University of Paris Saclay in engineering uh, sciences. Very long history of relation between France and India, thanks to uh, Puducherry, Madras and the Tamil Nadu. So it's no surprise that Tamil Nadu uh, is the home of more than 170 French companies, which is about a third of the French company French companies doing business in India. And uh, of course, in Tamil Nadu, we have our two major French car builders, uh, as uh, Chennai is the automotive hub of India. But we also have IT companies with Capgemini, Numeric, uh, Soprasteria. We also have uh, uh, in the field of defense, aeronautic, food industry. So French companies are acting in almost every sector uh, here in Tamil Nadu. And they have announced uh, uh, substantial investment plans, if just talking about our uh, automotive companies, Renault and Stellantis, our two majors, they both uh, announced substantial investment uh, here in Chennai. Renault signed an MOU with the government of Tamil Nadu uh, a few months back, uh, planning to invest uh, 600, billion, uh, 600 million euros, and uh, they're going to hire 200, 2,000, sorry, 2,000 more uh, engineers and technicians at the R&D uh, center here in Chennai. Stellantis is launching its first uh, made in India, um, conceived in India and made in India uh, electric vehicles called the EC3. Uh, they launched in, uh, in, 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 in Feb. Uh, so you see the dynamic is, uh, is, uh, is, is big and uh, some other big French companies have announced investments. So this is, this is growing and uh, it's, uh, we have a lot of perspectives here in Tamil Nadu.